Marshall, to someone that's never seen it, is a ghost town. But to a local like me, I know the things that you can do for fun around here. You know, as far as bowling alleys and arcades and stuff like that that you would see in the bigger towns, we don't have anything. But, you know, the people around here, we've adapted. We fish and we hunt and canoe. We use the resources we have. Marshall High School is located in Marshall, Arkansas. It's in Searcy County. It's a very rural county, a very high poverty county. Our free and reduced lunch count is at 70%. We do have students that may not have permanent housing. We know we've had students in the past that lived in tents. Their parents may have to go to the local spring to get water. I went to school here my entire career. I met my husband here. We run the drive-in theater here in town. You know, I see these kids during the day and then I see them at night. But that's, I think, one of our selling points because we know our kids. These are some of the things, like the three points. Right, you guys made up. You know, anything that our students need, we will turn over any rock and make sure we meet the needs that they have. I've had teachers actually go to Fred's you know, and pick up clothes and bring back to school for students. If we have students who may not have water at home, we have opportunity for those students to come in and take showers. At the beginning of the school year, we take a survey on who might need extra food at home. And then we get a backpack and we put that kid's name on it and we fill it with food supplies. And then on Fridays, we take those around and we pass them out to those kids send it home so they always have something to eat. You gotta meet those physical needs before you can meet their educational needs. When we meet as teams, we talk about kids. And sometimes that's frowned on, you know, in education. You're never supposed to talk about a kid and call them by name. Yes, we do. We talk about, this kid's having trouble here. Did he have trouble with that last year? Is this a trend? Where is that breaking down? Is it, is it a problem at home? You know, this kid's been doing well and now all of a sudden they're not. What's going on with this kid? And we have a lot of those discussions about kids. When we discover a kid that has a skill gap, then we use a point in time intervention to address that gap. We do have a math interventionist. We have a person that's employed that that is her sole goal. She pulls them out of study hall, and she pulls them even out of class. They go to her if they have a question. If kids want to go to college, we will do everything in our power to make sure that they get what they need to be successful when they go to college. Most of our students are coming from families that are first-generation college students. So they've not had an experience with applying to college, with researching careers. Um, so we try our best to sit down one-on-one -on -one with them to make that process less scary. From seventh grade, our kids are being exposed to financial aid resources and to colleges around our area. Our school hosts an event to help parents and students fill out their FAFSA so that we are able to sit down one-on-one -on -one with our kids and the parents and get their application complete. Our school has been very successful in getting money for our students. Last year we were able to um, acquire about $1.8 million through financial aid and scholarships for our students. There hasn't been a single scholarship form that I filled out that someone in this school hasn't helped me with. I mean, they have helped me with every step of the process. When I was 13, I started working in the rock quarry with my stepdad and my dad. I was stacking pallets of rock. And I'm thinking that with the college degree, I can get a job where by the time I'm 50, I'm not gonna be crippled. I've got one sibling that went to college I'll be the second one, and my family is just ecstatic between me and her that we've got people going to college now. <laughs>